party people welcome to the channel today i have a fun little video i recently have purchased a couple different pairs of jeans i'm honestly not a huge denim person partially because i'm like super super picky about like my denim jeans also i needed to get denim that i could wear to work so i couldn't have any denim with like any rips in them or anything i'm also only allowed to wear dark denim to vendor appointments so like pretty much just black jeans so i do have some black jeans to show you that i actually think are really cute and that i'm not just gonna wear to work like i'm definitely gonna wear them out and about but i also wanted to get some like trendy denim i feel like the reason i don't like denim is because it's so boring to me but recently i feel like there's been different kinds of denim that are like a little bit more trendy kind of like the baggy denim a little bit street style kind of vibes personally though i do love a light wash denim like my favorite kind of denim pants are usually light wash so i have a light wash i have two black pairs of jeans so why don't we just get into it i have two pairs of levi jeans and then a pair of jeans from asos but the brand is urban revivo which i've actually purchased from that brand before i think i only bought a top from them i've never bought their bottoms before but i love the top that i bought from them so urban revivo is definitely like a brand on asos to watch out for because they have really really cute clothes but anyways i'm just going to show you all of the pairs of denim pants that i bought and then i'll try them on and obviously talk about the quality and the fit and all of that good stuff all right let's just start with our levi's so first i'm actually probably most excited about these pants i saw them on the website recently which if you're wondering i'm looking at my computer down here it has all of the info but these are the levi's baggy dad woman's jeans they're 108 dollars but i did get them on sale for 76 dollars which was really exciting they were having like a huge sale last week which they actually do still have a sale going on but i think it's like a slightly different sale right now if you spend over 125 dollars you get 30 percent off whereas when i bought them i didn't have to spend 135 dollars i just got a discount on them so unfortunately i feel like it's not as good of a deal but it's still good and then i just got them in the color black stone wash and i got them in a size 26 which honestly i'm not really good with jeans sizes i based the size off of a different pair of jeans that i recently bought in a store and i tried them on and everything so i'm hoping the 26 fits but obviously we'll see when i try them on but basically they're just like these oversized baggy jeans which is definitely a trend i'm seeing more and honestly i'm really getting into it i used to only buy ultra ultra skinny jeans and now i'm really into the baggy jeans and it says these are mid rise with the straight legs so they're not like super high rise which again i feel like i was always the kind of person and that would only buy like ultra high rise skinny jeans now we're going for a mid rise you know we're going for the baggy look and i also got them in the length 30 i guess like a 30 inch inseam i'm pretty sure that means they also had a 28 inch inseam option when i checked some of the reviews basically people were saying the 30 would be like touching the floor kind of fit and if you wanted it a little bit cropped you would go for the shorter length personally i have a lot of jeans that are like slightly cropped you know that kind of like slightly cropped jean look that's really going around pretty much every pair of jeans i own is like a slightly cropped jean where it like shows my shoes and my ankles i didn't really want something like that i wanted something like baggy oversized like touching the floor so i went with a 30 inch and seam length so we'll see how that fits and for reference i am 5'5 five five, like my height the other thing that I like about these jeans is that they have a zipper with the button. The other Levi jeans I bought have like the full button up, which honestly are so annoying to put on when you have to button like five buttons in the front. It's just not the vibe. So I really like that this is just a zipper with one button. Obviously you got the pockets in the front, pockets in the back, you got the little Levi thingy here and then yeah the bottom are just like baggy they're honestly not super baggy though i kind of was expecting them to be a little bit wider at the bottom um so i'm kind of interested to see how these are gonna fit just a side note you can also buy these on revolve's website i saw them on revolve and i almost bought them on revolve because revolve usually has like really fast shipping and it's usually free shipping but on revolve's website these were on sale and these obviously were on sale on the levi website so i just bought them on the levi website okay you guys so first we have the levi's dad baggy jeans i'm pretty sure they're called i'm trying to like show the full pant and my camera angle is always just absolutely absurd and i'm sorry but i'll try to like 
get the full view somehow but it's just it's very difficult in my space so far they're definitely super cute they're definitely big on me which is interesting because i feel like 26 usually isn't big on me and i did try the other levi pants on already in the size 26 and those ones fit me like pretty perfectly and these ones are like definitely oversized so that's a little bit interesting it really doesn't bother me though because i feel like it kind of goes with the whole baggy look to have it baggy at the waist and baggy like in the leg area obviously so i don't know part of me feels like i should exchange them for a smaller size but the other part of me is like i don't know kind of goes with goes with the vibe a little bit but technically i do think they are a little bit big and for reference i would say i almost always buy a size six in all pants there are times where i can size down to a four but almost always I'm a size six. But I also do kind of have like a weird body type because I have like a wider waist. I definitely don't have like an hourglass figure at all. I have a really wide rib cage and like wide shoulders and a wider waist. My waist doesn't go in as much as like most girls waists go in, I feel like, um, which is amazing. I love being built like a quarterback, probably more like a linebacker actually, but you know, it is what it is. God's actually rude for that. But anyway, I don't know. So I feel like when I talk about my size, it doesn't really make sense to most people because they expect me to be like a smaller size than I am but because my waist is like wider than normal I usually have to wear like a wider waist size than maybe people would expect but yeah definitely a little baggy but honestly I kind of like it I will say for being marketed as like a baggy jean they're not that baggy they're very much giving straight leg vibes which was not the vibe I was going for I mean am I crazy and thinking these aren't that baggy I really don't think they are. I still like them. Like, I like the way they look. I definitely want to keep them. I feel like the quality is really nice. I feel like you cannot go wrong with Levi's quality. But they're definitely not the look that I was expecting. And they definitely looked baggier on the model on the website. So I guess I'm just a little bit confused that they're not that baggy in person. This is what the, like, waistband looks like. That's how big it is on me, if you can tell. That's probably easier to see. So definitely, like you know considerably big the back's pretty basic i feel like these aren't super booty enhancing like they definitely don't make the butt look that nice because they are that baggy oversized look so it's giving a little bit of pancake butt vibes but that's totally fine yeah i don't know i really like them i think they're super cute it's just they're definitely not as baggy as i thought so if you really want like an over exaggerated baggy look these probably aren't for you also i would just say be careful when you buy the size like definitely look at the size chart to make sure you get the right size because obviously these are like way big on me but yeah definitely keeping these i really really like the style love the black jean look i just think they're super super cute next we have a pair of light wash denim from levi's i love this light wash color i just think it's so cute i feel like light wash can look kind of tacky depending on the shade of like light wash it is but i love this color i mean i just think it's so cute and these are the levi's rib cage straight ankle women's jeans on the levi's website they're actually on sale just on their own for 81 dollars so you don't have to spend like the 120 to get the discount they're already on sale for 80 and on the website it says that these jeans are levi's highest high rise yet which i didn't actually know when i bought them so now i'm like oh very interesting i guess it's a soaring 12 inch rise okay apparently that's really high and obviously it says it's a straight leg and it hits at the ankle honestly in person these look really similar to the baggy jeans like they don't look too incredibly different on the leg i don't know maybe when i try try them on they'll look different but the baggy jeans honestly don't look that much baggier than these jeans um obviously i haven't tried them on yet so i don't really know but kind of interesting these i also got in a size 26 basically funny story about these i actually bought these jeans at ross dress for less they had these jeans at ross i was shopping there a few weeks ago and i saw these and i was like excuse me what ross doesn't always have like a ton of levi's i mean they always have some selection of levi's but i've never ever found a pair of like cute levi's if you know what i mean not personally but when i saw these at ross i was shook and i'm almost positive i got them for 20 dollars at ross just for less 
$20. So maybe if you have a Ross near you, maybe you run on over to Ross and see if they have these jeans in your size in stock. Not to be negative, but I wouldn't be surprised if they're all already sold out because I feel like usually like things like this at Ross are gone within a day. But yeah, I did think that was pretty amazing that I got these at Ross for $20. Although I will say a downside with these, like I just mentioned, is they are the full button up in the front, which... I already told you is not the vibe but honestly like it doesn't bother me enough to want to return them it's just not like the most ideal but yeah this is what they kind of look like it's kind of hard to show it um you'll see it better when i try them on but obviously got the pockets in the front you got the pockets in the back very similar look to black jeans also these jeans come in a 27 inch length inseam and also a 29 length inseam and i honestly don't know which inseam length these are i wouldn't be surprised if they're the 27 length because they are like a little bit cropped but i'll try to figure that out and like put the information somewhere okay guys and then here we have the levi's light wash jeans off the bat they're definitely more noticeably like high-waisted which obviously they did say that in the description they don't even feel like super duper high-waisted even though they market it as like their most high-waisted jeans i mean obviously they're high-waisted they're clearly above my belly button but my belly button's like right here so they're not crazy high-waisted in my opinion but i do like where they're hitting on my waist i feel like they're super flattering i feel like definitely a little bit more butt enhancing with these jeans and these ones that definitely fit me better like i said they're the same exact size as the black jeans a size 26 waist and they fit me so much better than the black ones i don't know if it's because they're high-waisted or if it's something else like if the other jeans just run large but they definitely like fit me better i just love these i think they are so cute i love the color i love the light wash they definitely fit a little bit more snug throughout the leg than the baggy dad jeans definitely a little bit more of a straight leg but again to me they don't seem that much different than the baggy jeans the baggy jeans definitely aren't hugely more baggy than these so i just feel like that's kind of interesting but these are slightly cropped Ugh, i don't know if you can see that it's really gonna bother me they hit pretty much right where my ankle is or they hit like right above my ankle which i don't mind obviously i said i already have a ton of like cropped jeans so it's not necessarily my favorite length i kind of wish they were as long as the black jeans but honestly i do like where they're hitting i feel like some of the other cropped jeans that i have are like a little bit more cropped than these and i like that these are hitting like right where my ankle is rather than hitting like a couple inches above the ankle i feel like these just are a little bit cuter again this is what they look like up close with my top kind of up and then if i put my top down and then the back like i said i feel like the back is a little bit more flattering a little bit more butt enhancing than the baggy jeans i mean partially just because they're a light wash so they show off your figure a little bit more but they are tighter and a little bit more form fitting yeah i love these highly recommend i feel like the fit is super super nice i definitely feel like they're very flattering i love the color i love the wash of these jeans honestly this is like my favorite shade of light wash jean that i think i own i just think the wash on these is so cute definitely keeping these love them okay you guys and lastly we got a pair of asos jeans like i said the urban revivo brand if you can see the little label here and these are called the urban revivo straight leg seam front denim jeans in black they are 64 dollars and you guys when i saw these on the website i immediately fell in love with them simply for the fact that they have these like seams running down the front i don't know why i was so obsessed with that kind of look but i just feel like jeans can look so boring and like not interesting at all and when i saw like the seam detail i just felt like it looked so different than any other jean that i've seen like i don't know why i just really love the seam look and these are definitely marketed as like a baggy jean i can already tell that these jeans are a lot baggier than the levi's jeans even though the levi's jeans are literally called the baggy dad jean and these aren't necessarily marketed as baggy jeans but they are definitely bigger on the bottom which i kind of like like i've been wanting a baggy dad jean vibe and I'm just really really excited about these i did get these in a size medium which it does say it's a us 6 but when i went and did like the size test thing it said i should have got a size small which technically is a us 4 so i'm a little bit worried about the fit on these they do look a little bit big in person which i don't mind if they're a little bit too big just because again i'm kind of going for the baggy look but 
I don't know, I'm just kind of worried about that. And it says these are a regular rise with straight fit, which straight fit I feel like is pushing it because they're definitely really baggy. But to be fair, they're kind of baggy throughout the whole pant. So it is kind of like a straight fit considering it's like baggy all the way through. Um, I don't know a lot about pants, so I'm probably making absolutely no sense, but they're definitely baggy. And these also just have the zipper with the one button at the top. All right, you guys, lastly, we have the Urban Revivo jeans, which are definitely fitting bigger than I was expecting. Um, I know I mentioned that I thought they might be a little bit too big because I realized after I purchased them that I might have bought the wrong size, and I definitely did. Interestingly enough, I feel like they run just as big as the Levi's almost, but for whatever reason, the Levi's still fit me better. Like, even though it's coming out pretty much just as much as the Levi's these still feel a lot more uncomfortable like around the top especially even on like my crotch area I feel like it feels very baggy on the crotch area which is definitely not the most flattering look and I feel like I can even like pick them up a lot more whereas the Levi's they did sit more comfortably whereas with these I feel like I want to keep pulling them up but they just like don't sit right Oh, I don't know. Something's definitely off about the fit here. Other than the fact that they obviously are just too big on me. But I feel like the Levi's passed, even though they were a little bit too big. These ones definitely aren't going to cut it. I'm definitely either going to need to exchange these or just return them because the fit is definitely not fitting. I do love like the seam detail running down the front. I think it's so trendy and so cute. Obviously like a very simple detail, but I just feel like it works. But they are also super long. <laughs> like they're very, very long. Unlike the Levi jeans, there was no option to pick a jean length. They just come in one size for all the lengths. So obviously, I don't know, that doesn't really help because they're so long. I can't even imagine getting the small that these would fit because of how long they are and how big they are. And then I feel like on the butt, I just feel like they look really baggy and not flattering at all. Why do I feel like I look like I'm wearing a diaper? It's very much giving diaper vibes. I mean, they're just so big. There's like so much extra fabric everywhere. Also, something about the shape seems weird to me. Like, I don't really like the way the shape looks. I feel like they balloon out in kind of a funny way. That doesn't really look good. I don't know. Sadly, these are definitely a fail. I thought I would like these so much more and I was so excited to get these in the mail, but I just feel like they're not working, which is really sad because I feel like they had so much potential. Obviously the fit is atrocious and already the quality I can tell is not as good as the Levi's, which makes sense. I mean, Levi's is kind of known for their quality and I feel like ASOS is very hit and miss with their quality depending on the label but these are definitely like not the best quality they do feel a little bit scratchier and a little bit just like less comfy and nice so I'll probably be returning these unfortunately but they're cute if the fit was right I would definitely keep these all right, you guys, well, that was everything. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions at all, as always, leave them in the comments below. I'll we'll answer any and all questions. Definitely loving the Levi jeans that I got today. Definitely keeping both of the Levi's, but unfortunately, I will be returning the ASOS jeans. I just feel like the fit it's just not working for me and honestly i don't really feel good about getting this small either just because overall the construction and the shape of the jeans just doesn't seem perfect and if i'm going to spend money on jeans like they need to be perfect or they're going back you know what i mean so yeah if you're interested in purchasing any of the jeans that i showed today all of the jeans will be linked down below and I'll also just like put my size information and everything down there in case you need it i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day please comment like and subscribe i really really appreciate it and i'll see you all in the next video bye